Hi folks, welcome back to the ward. You know it's a bit scary? The leaves are starting to change. I guess it's, uh, what is it today, the 7th, the 8th, September. Um, I guess it's getting to be that time. But uh, obviously some of us are not ready for winter. Yeah, see the, uh, the trees out there? They're just starting to to get pick up a little yellow um, anyway what I want to do is take a look at this mini bike and I'm gonna make a decision today on what to do with it um, you guys remember this came from the um, it wasn't the garage sale it was uh, Labor Day Stormville flea market I got this one and another one and they were they were um, 350 bucks. Um, just quickly, whenever you look at a bike, you say, hey, what's cooking, what's not cooking, what's nice, what's not nice. I mean, the throttle seems to work, right? So that should be good. Um, doesn't feel like it's got too much brake there. And the adjuster, so it could use a set of rear brakes. I don't have the guard, it didn't come with that. Um, let's check the oil. I mean, this is real time, right? We're gonna figure out if this bike is worth doing anything with or trading it off. I got a buddy who's after it. Oh, so let's check the oil. By the way, I don't know if this is a real Honda motor or not. Look at that. The oil looks good, it looks clean. Let's see if it's full. Right. Oh, it's not only looks good, but looks like it's about fall. I mean, I would, if I were going to ride this thing right now, I would put a little more in it. By the way, this is. Let's see what year this rig is. One, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So this is an 05 also. So this is a 2005. I think that's the better ones. I think they're made a little better. Um, I don't, once again, I don't know if this is a real Honda engine. I mean, it says Honda on it, but that could be a replacement. The Hondas did have the on and off right there. So, I'm not sure. Um, given that it's got oil in it, that makes it safe to start. This is the on and off switch here. So, it needs some love and attention. I showed you the throttle was okay. Why don't we give it a hoot of ether and see what happens. Alright. If it pops, that's one thing. If it doesn't... Oh, just quickly, let me show you the... I mean, to really look in this gas tank, this one has to come off. Um, but the gas tank, from what I can see of it, the gas tank, gas tank looks okay. So that's all. It's all goodness. Doesn't seem to have gas in it. it seems to be empty. Um, you got to turn this around so that the uh, I'm gonna have to pull it out again. Anyway, I'll fix this up. There it is. Yeah, you see, you got to fix it up so that the alignment works, or the gas cap ain't going back on. So the gas cap is back on. Um, yeah, the only two things that seems to be missing is this and the on and off switch. Oh, the air filter and the guard. Other than that, it looks complete. The tires seem to hold air. That one does. How's the back holding up? Back could use some air. 
anyway, let's see if the piece of stuff <laughs> will fire up or not. Got my official camera stand right here. Let's set you up. So this um, this is the old-fashioned ether. Um, I got like four cans of it from a guy. You can tell it's all rusty. It's the kind of ether that uh, I think will jumpstart a seized engine. I mean, it's uh, it's the good stuff. Just the hood will do you. We got something going on. Try this again. Must want a little more hoop. This thing feels like it's gonna to wanna to run away. And I just assume not crash it into anything important. So it uh, starts, it runs, it moves. Um, and I told you I was gonna make a decision. I had a buddy of mine who's um, whose name rhymes with very busy. <laughs> Who made me an offer on this thing? And honestly, I'm I'm having trouble with storage, so I'm going to accept I'm going to accept his offer. Um, and I'm hoping I'm hoping that he keeps keeps it and he turns it into a theme bike uh, because it's got all the right bones for that. I, I'm hoping that he uh, that he doesn't he doesn't let it go. I'm, I'm hoping that he uses the bones for a theme bike. I mean, it's got a good motor. I, I'm hoping that's a real Honda. I don't know. Um, this, I think the cover's been changed, but the color's the right color for a Honda, and the on and off switch is in the right place for a Honda. I don't know if that's the right sticker for a Honda. One would have to take it apart and take it off and all. Um... Though it has a cruddy spark plug in it, um, I don't know. Maybe a Honda, maybe not. Uh, you guys weren't looking. Did the headlight work? I mean, the forks work. Great. Bouncy, bouncy. So, yeah, I, I think I think this this is going to move move on to a uh, to a new home. You know the. The other situation you run into, if you're not going to store them properly, this seat is okay, and it'll come back. It'll come back with um, a little bit of uh, love and attention, a little of that sealer stuff um, for wires. That'll take care of those couple of cracks. Um, you know, a little preservative on it will come back. But if I, by next year, if I leave it out, it won't be in very good shape. I mean, he could redo the gas tank as he wishes. So, yeah, I, th I think I'm going to have to let this one go. I just, I got the other one up by the garage. I got a deal cooking with him, which is going to bring home another bike. I, um, I'm... My storage is is full, so I I think this one this one's gonna have to have to move on. It's a good project for my friend uh, David. You dizzy? You guys all gasped when I said too busy, but um, yeah, I think I'm gonna I'm gonna take his offer and uh, and let this go. I hate to because you know there's a whole bunch of uh, project videos here. You know where you get it off and you fix the seat, straighten the fenders, paint them out, do the gas tank or, or put a motorcycle gas tank on it. I mean there's a lot of a lot of good videos for this bike, but um, I can't 
I, I, I'm out of space, so I think I gotta let it go. Um, I'm gonna go inside to cry for a little while now at actually parting with something. Kidding, folks, kidding. But, um, I, I'm gonna let it go. Anyway, folks, I want to thank you all and uh, for watching and commenting and subscribing. Thanks for your support, your advice, um, y you know, and counsel. We'll catch up with you guys for a video tomorrow. All right. Bye now, folks.